Hi, I'm Carson. Good morning, middle school. The three students that were randomly chosen to be added to our opening prayer for today are 5th grader Bryn Bazemore, 6th grader Summer Grace Cowart, and 8th grader Colton Villa. Now over to the pledge. Hi, I'm Colin. Please stand as I lead you in the pledge. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now over for the prayer. Please bow your heads and pray with me. Dear God, please let Bryn, Summer Grace, and Colton rely on your love as they are presented with challenges. Thank you for putting us in this place, surrounding us with teachers, students, and family that love us. Help us to remember to thank them and appreciate them. We know they are a gift from you. In your name we pray, amen. Have a great day, Bryn, Summer Grace, and Colton. Now over to the anchors. Hi, everybody. I'm Brendan. And I'm Aiden. And here are your middle school homeroom announcements for Wednesday, September 23rd, 2015. Welcome to Wednesday. Attention all middle school artists. The Wesleyan Artist Market is now accepting applications for the upcoming 2016 Artist Market. This three-day event is April 28th through the 30th, 2016, and is one of the biggest school events of the year. This is your reminder to get in an application now. Your applications can be submitted online only. Photos and samples of your artwork are required. The deadline is Friday, December 4th, 2015. But get them in early. Please visit www.wesleyanartistmarket.org to apply and to get more information. The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe is being performed this week in Linky Theater. At this point, all tickets are sold out. But however... Ten walk-up tickets will be available 45 minutes before each show. The applications for the October WWTV team must be turned in to Ms. Kelleher by this Friday. You may get an application from Ms. Kelleher or in the bin outside the middle school office. The October team will be announced on Tuesday, September 29th, and you will come in for training on Friday, October 3rd. If you have any questions, see Ms. Kelleher. Math Counts will begin meeting this Friday, September 25th, in room 160 at 7.05 a.m. Come give it a try if you would like to join in on the problem-solving fun. See Ms. Punk if you have any questions. All swim and dive apparel orders are due to be turned in no later than this Friday. If you want to swim and dive and have not yet received a packet, you must get a packet from Ms. Hanlon's office, room 142. If you have any questions, email Ms. Hanlon at ahanlon at wesleyanschool.org. This Friday, September 25th, will be an out-of-uniform day for all students and faculty in the middle school. This is to show support for the home football game. This home <laughs> game's theme is pink out. So keep in mind that when you pick your outfits to attend the game. For the school day, wear any Wesleyan, sh wear any Wesleyan shirt with jeans, khakis, or uniform bottom, but no shorts. You may wear sneakers, but no boots or flip-flops. Jeans should be clean looking with no rips, holes, or frays. If you have any questions, check with your homeroom teacher, grade chair, or Mr. Greco. Now over for the birthdays. Hi, I'm Sarah. Today we have two middle school birthdays to announce. Happy birthday to 6th grader Walker Edge and 5th grader Sophia Schaefer. We hope you enjoy your special day and happy birthday. Now over for the do you know question. Hi, I'm Naomi. And I'm Mackenzie. Do you know... Which person has claimed the following verse as their favorite? Let your light so shine before men that they may see your good works and glorify, glorify your Father which is in heaven. Is it? A. Miss Russell. B. Mr. Griffin. C. Miss Nicole Dixon. D. Mr. Antonio. If you guess D. Mr. Antonio, you are correct. He said he chose this verse because he thinks it's so profound that Jesus calls himself the light of the world and then calls us the light of the world as well. 
This verse makes clear that we should live and perform and do things in such a way that other people glorify God, not us. Because Mr. Antonio dis struggles with um, pride and wanting other people to think he is great, these words from Jesus remind him that he is that his focus to glorify God and let other people see Christ in him. Great reminder. Thanks, Mr. Antonio. Now, now over for the, the lunch menu. menu. Hi, I'm Bennett. And I'm William. Today's soups are... Chicken corn chowder. Creamy tomato soup. And for the hot entree choices you'll have... Italian stromboli. Greek pita pocket. Roasted rosemary red potatoes. Steamed carrots. And roasted br br Brussels sprouts. Today, we also have a special station set up with creamy pasta paravera. Primavera, sorry. Curry black, be curry, black bean, and salad. And for dessert today, we'll have fresh baked cookies and ice, ice cream. cream. Thank you for watching WWTV.